nitrates and nitrates uh, by uh, soil bacteria making a nitrogen available to plants nitrogen oxide uh, family of nitrogen gases that can be uh, generated by a human activity and related to uh, the atmosphere next one is a saline soil what is a saline soil so uh, saline soil uh, with a higher content of soluble salts and negatively affect the soil process productivity uh, and uh, overall soil health sodic soil soil with a high content of salts and poor structure water uh, infiltration and the drainage is uh, prevented soil electrical conductivity a measure of the amount of soil in uh, salts in soil soil electrical conductivity soil electrical conductivity affects the yield crops table of plant nutrient availability and soil microorganism activity such as the emissions of the greenhouse gases and uh, respiration excess salts uh, hinder plant uh, by affecting the soil plant, water balance uh, third one is the arid and semi arid climates naturally have a higher salt content and salinity is influenced by a humans through a cropping uh, irrigation and the land management practices and heritant factor affecting a soil uh, electrical conductivity climate so climate uh, salts are more easily uh, flushed through uh, soil located in areas of uh, high rainfall areas a uh, salt area flows below the root zone into a ground water or streams salts accumulate in a soil uh, sound uh, and dry areas inheritance of the affecting soil is the mineral content mineral content soil comes from uh, the weathering of a mineral rocks found in soil factors for converting a very salinity unit to a ac cement per meter uh, total soluble salt so uh, Here is the unit conversion a uh, meter square per centimeter to a decimeter per uh, meter uh, into a one like a more centimeter uh, per uh, per unit to a deci per meter uh, square uh, into one and meter second per meter square uh, uh, to a decimeter per uh, uh, inverse into a zero point zero one so uh, lots of uh, factor for uh, converting the uh, Uh, 70 units. The EC value is the uh, inversely proportional to the water content as an indirect, uh, uh, indirected uh, in the uh, uh, conversions. Like uh, EC of one ratio one is equal to two EC. Uh, one ratio uh, two is equal to five EC. One ratio five. So it should uh, however, however, be. Uh, recalled that is a proportion uh, proportionality be, uh, between a soil concentration and the soil moisture content only a holds a true for a higher soluble salt like uh, uh, sodium chloride and sodium sulfate for a slightly soluble salt like uh, um, lime uh, calcium carbonate and to a lesser extent a calcium uh, sulfate uh, so gypsum uh, like gypsum uh, similar values of the concentration ratio apply as in the precipitation of this salt occurs upon a concentration so exchangeable sodium percentage also here important here the exchangeable sodium percentage uh, corresponded uh, to the amount of absorbed uh, sodium Compared to the EC, uh, can exchange capacity and is expressed exp expressed like uh, 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 can exchange uh, exchangeable sodium percentage is equal to uh, exchange sodium percentage uh, into a hundred uh, upon can exchange capacity. So can exchange capacity of the soil, the affected soil, composed mainly of uh, sodium, calcium, and magnesium as the dominated. Mm, exchangeable cation can be expressed as uh, 
कैटायन एक्सचेंज कैपेसिटी इज इक्वल टू एक्सचेंज सोडियम एंड एक्सचेंज कैल्शियम प्लस एक्सचेंज मैग्नीशियम है तो वेयर हियर वेयर कैटायन एक्सचेंज कैपेसिटी इन द कैटायन एक्सचेंज कैपेसिटी ऑफ द सॉइल इन द मो kg per dry soil and uh, exchange sodium exchange uh, calcium exchange magnesium and the corresponded to the amount of the absorbed sodium calcium and magnesium respectively the uh, exchange of sodium percentage and the expression of the sodicity and the dispersion or tendency of the soil the soil solution has a major influence on the chemical properties of the soil absorption complex as uh, uh uh given by uh, uh gapon's equations like uh, uh, exchange sodium up, upon exchange calcium plus exchange uh, magnesium is equal to okay uh, percentage sodium upon the uh, under root of calcium and the magnesium is plus magnesium is equal to upon the two so there is key term that is gapon constant in the exchange coefficient which has a value Ranging a bit between a zero point zero ten to zero point zero nine uh, liter square. Uh, the concentration uh, of hydrogen, uh, uh, so sorry, sodium and calcium and magnesium in the soil solution as uh, the expressed in the milliliter. The uh, Gapon equation demonstrate uh, demonstrates that a more concentrated soil solution results in a higher amount of uh, exchange sodium percentage at the expense of a uh, 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 exchange calcium and exchange magnesium. Uh, uh, increasing and the increases the exchangeable sodium percentage in the case of the dilution of the exchange calcium and the exchange magnesium will uh, replace uh, exchange sodium and uh, est will uh, decrease cation exchange uh, exchangeable uh, sorry exchangeable sodium percentage so the determination of the exchangeable sodium percentage can be made following appropriate procedure in the laboratory however um for a routine analysis of the large soil sample this determination is uh, too time consuming also it uh, requires expert handling the unless carefully determined it um, might lead to a uh, erroneous results uh, although um, the relationship between the ph and esp is a complex when applied to a wide range of a soil yet ph may be used as the satisfactory indication of the exchangeable sodium or a similar types of soil so for the um, recommendation point of view point of view ph and the uh, exchangeable sodium percentage of the soil of the endogangetic plants are a well uh, co uh, correct uh, correlated uh, Since pH can be uh, easily and rapidly determined in the laboratory, uh, this parameter has uh, widely been used to uh, assess the degree of the sodicity of the endogangetic plants in some areas. If the uh, relationship between a pH and uh, electric uh, exchangeable sodium percentage, it uh, is not uh, satisfactory. The more uh, Uh, tenders uh, determination of the um, cation exchange capacity and the uh, exchangeable sodium may be required to uh, uh, elevated uh, sodicity and uh, related recrimination problems. So, uh, relationship between a uh, pH and uh, like, uh, exchangeable sodium percentage of the soils. Uh, Of the endogangetic plants like a zero point, uh, sorry, eight to eight point two pH uh, here, so uh, exchangeable sodium percentage twenty eight point two to eight point four to uh, exchangeable sodium percentage twenty to thirty five. So pH as and pH two are a pH of the saturated soil based uh, and one ratio to soil water suspension uh, respectively. So. <laughs> Sodium absorption ratio because of the equilibrium ex uh, uh, existing be between the soil and soil solution, it is 
possible to measure the sodicity from uh, uh, sodium absorption ratio derived uh, from the concentration of sodium calcium and magnesium in the soil solution so uh, sodium absorption ratio is equal to sodium uh upon uh, under root calcium uh, square plus uh, magnesium square uh, uh, um, upon 2 so where is sodium absorption ratio uh is the uh, uh, uh is the sodium absorption ratio of the saturation extract of the soil the uh, sodium uh, absorption ratio can be determined in the laboratory more easily than uh, electrical uh, exchangeable sodium percentage and help uh, estimate the uh, exchange sodium percentage from a combination of the equation uh, like uh, first and uh, second which is uh, already uh, i told told you so oh, uh, e, uh, esp is equal uh, kg uh, and uh, uh, sodium absorption ratio upon a 1 plus a kg uh, sodium uh, absor absorption ratio uh, into 100 so for a wide range of soil for a following uh, like a relation uh, here uh, get a uh, exchangeable sodium percentage is equal to 100 uh, upon a uh, 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 sodium absorption ratio uh, into uh, upon 1 uh, plus a sodium percentage uh, ratio here so managing us uh, now managing our soil easy cropping uh, cropping so cropping uh, leave a crop residues to add organic matter and to limit the evaporation low organic matter uh, plus poor infiltration and the poor drainage and saturated soil compaction uh, is equal to increase electrical conductivity and a decrease in the soil uh, ability to buffer so managing uh, irrigation irrigation the salinity of water affected the salinity of soil extra water can help of flush salts from uh, the soil uh, managing our soil electrical conductivity land use land use ensuring uh, that the least amount of the compaction and the erosion occur improves soil electrical conductivity Managing our soil application fertilizers, uh, manure compost application of fertilizer, manure compost monitoring or uh, to uh, municipal waste is necessary. Nitrogen increase salinity. Uh, soil function and EC. As the EC uh, electrical conductivity increases, the soil microorganism activity decreases, affecting the respiration residues. decomposition nitrification and denitrification so the soil have a poor soil structure and the poor infiltration and drainage as well as the increases toxicity so in electrical conductivity conductivity indirectly indicates the amount of water and water soluble nutrient available for the plant uptake so uh, reclimination and management of a soil affected uh, soils also uh, we talked about it but uh, uh, some more uh, points here uh, the primary object of reclimination and management of soil affected soil is to our residues of soluble salt and exchangeable sodium to leave the and that permit uh, ideal or near ideal plant growth uh, so that uh, the productivity of this soil is uh, restored for that uh, re replacement of uh, excess sodium ions from the exchange complex and leaching out the salt uh, below that the root zone of to do uh, um, uh, I can please uh, that the uh, provision of the adequate drainage index, uh, seen box uh, index. Uh, it is a pre uh, request to uh, uh, achieve this objective without adequate drainage. Uh, uh, I can please uh, to give us a little bit of uh, a. Overnight, it takes accumulated enough to uh, reduce crop growth. 
in the root zone however in the case of oric soil and uh, inadequate the quantities of the sand silt rather create problem due to a sand cementing effect in such cases a large quantities of the sand have to be uh, applied to check the cementing effect that that at a time seems uh, in practical for a large area fishing involves washing away uh, the surface accumulated salts by the flushing water over the surface it is uh, sometimes used to uh, uh, desalinize the soil having a surface salt crust because uh, the amount of salt that can be flushed from the a uh, soil is the rather small it uh, this matter does not have much practical significance cupping um, the salt that have accumulated on the soil surface by mechanical means has had only limited success although may uh, many farmers have reported to the uh, procedure it might a uh, temporary improve crop growth but uh, the unlimited disposal of a salt still uh, poses a major problem also this method fails to uh, give a uh, permanent solution under shallow water tables uh, condition where salt uh, can again rise and accumulated at the surface due to uh, at the uh, at uh, due to uh, uh, at Vapor transpiration, chemical re re uh, reclamation, chemical reclamation of the sodic uh, soil requires the removal of the parts or most of the extensible sodium removal of the sodium physical structure and the lowering of the soil pH. The extensible sodium replaced by the more favorable calcium ions according to the exchangeable re re reaction given in uh, uh, by equation uh, like uh, so uh, two sodium uh, minus x uh, plus uh, calcium is equal to calcium x uh, plus two sodium so uh, where x is the exchangeable complex calcium needed for the, this relation can be uh, furnished by the other calcium based uh, am amendment or calcium carbonate present in the soil whose uh, uh, solubility may be enhanced by the application of organic
is a particular importance in uh, the absorption of the water and the circulation of air uh, a desirable uh, structure should have a higher proportion of medium size aggregates uh, and and a perceivable number of uh, and a appreciable uh, number of the large pores uh, Uh, through which water and air can move the structure of uh, both uh, the b horizon and the a horizon is a very crucial to a, po- a proper drainage in uh, <coughs> infiltration and productivity in soil with a poor structure root penetration in limited thus the uh, reducing the plants access to water and nutrients the structure of the a horizon has received a great ideal uh, a great deal of uh, attention uh, because of the uh, its uh, relation to a uh, uh, seed bed preparation b uh, horizon uh, potential aeration water infiltration uh, overall uh, soil health so let's see soil structure the primary soil particles do not exit as uh, such uh, um such in a uh, natural condition but the broad uh, bonded uh, together into a large units of aggregates usually ter- termed uh, as uh, secondary particles these aggregates uh, formed under a natural condition are called a pads Uh, where an uh, irregular shaped uh, co- uh, coherent mass of soil formed uh, during a tillage operation is called a uh, uh, clod soil structure is uh, uh, defined as uh, the arrangement of a primary and second, uh, secondary soil particle in a uh, certain structure pattern this arrangement result in a formation of different sized uh, soil pores therefore a soil structure may also be defined as the arrangement of the various sized soil pores in certain structure pattern so now is the important of a soil uh, structure soil structure influence almost all the plant growth uh, factors uh, like a uh, water supply uh, retention uh aeration availability of a plant nutrient heat uh root penetration uh microbial activity and etc strong agri- uh, uh, aggregations be- uh, decreases uh uh decrease uh, decrease the detachability and uh, trans um, portability of a soil particles by a water and uh, wind uh, and thus uh, reduce the runoff and the soil erosion soil t- structure is a uh, useful for a classification of uh, soils uh, it is affected by a tillage cultivation and application of fertilizer manure lime gypsum and irrigation uh classifications of uh, soil structure uh, soil structure is uh, described and uh, classified based on uh, the types of uh, at, uh, the type as uh, determined by a uh, shape and arrangement the class as a uh, differentiated by a uh, size and third one is the grade as a uh, determined uh, by a uh, na uh, distinct names and the uh, durability of pads so types of structure types of structure based on uh, shape and arrangement uh, of a uh, pad soil structure is classified as a simple and the uh, compounds and simple structure natural uh, cleavage uh, planes are uh, absent simple structure is of uh, two types single uh, 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 sim- uh, simple granite and um, massive 
in single uh, single uh, gran uh, granite structure particles are completely uh, unattached to each other as in case of a loose sand and and uh, while in massive structure particles are the bonded uh, in a large cohesion non uh, structured mass in case of a surface crust uh, plow uh, pen and the clay pen in compound structure in compound structure natural cleavage uh, planes are visible with a naked eyes Uh, this shape are individual individual paired and uh, described according to relative length and vertical or and horizon axis by a shape and their uh, edges um, compound structure is a uh, uh, four uh, types of depending upon a shape Uh, and uh, and their character uh, characteristics like uh, uh, first one types of compound uh, soil structure and their characteristics type one is a blocky uh, blocky uh, all uh, the shape and characteristics of a blocky all the three dimensional uh, of a um, uh, pits uh, are uh, of about same size uh, providing uh, a shape of a block having a flat and rounded uh, face these pits are further uh, subdivided uh, uh, divided into a uh, angular blocky and the sub angular blocky in the former uh, face uh, are a flat and the edges are, and corner are sharp while in the uh, latter face and the edges are mainly uh, rounded the block is structure usually found in a b horizon and promotes a good drainage uh, aeration and root uh, penetration uh, second one is a prismatic prismatic uh, uh, the pads are uh, analog it uh, more in vertical than uh, in a horizontal uh, direction given a column like shape uh, vertical uh, cleavage uh, planes are the predominant when the top of pads are relatively angular uh, and flat is uh, called a prismatic and uh, when rounded it is called a column columnar Uh, a pr uh, prismatic structure commonly occurs in a uh, subsurface horizon in a arid and semi arid uh, region and poorly drainage uh, dra uh, poorly drained uh, soil of a humid region uh, having a swelling uh, type of clay a uh, platy platy uh, horizontal axis uh, is a uh, longer than a vertical axis uh, resulting the plate like uh, a, a appearance uh, horizontal cleavage planes are predominant uh, when the pad are uh, thick they are called uh, platy and when thin are uh, called a uh, laminar platy structure is often a inherit uh, inherited uh, from a parent material and may also be formed due to a compaction uh, uh, of a clay soil by a heavy machinery a plate a structure uh, restricted uh, infiltration and uh, percolation and aeration soil spherical pits are uh, roughly uh, spherical and granular uh, and subdivided into a granular and the uh, crumbs mm, granular structure is less uh, porous than the thumb due to a low organic uh, matter, uh, matter content spherical structure formed by a bio uh, biotic activity in surface horizon and uh, promotes sand infiltration uh, percolation aeration and root penetration in in uh, in soil classes of uh, uh, soil structure on the basis of uh, size aggregate uh, aggregates 
Each type of soil structure is further subdivided into uh, five uh, five classes. Mm, the size of aggregates is a uh, uh, certain number of uh, quantitative classifications of soil structure. Corus and sand uh, size aggregates are more favorable uh, for a uh, plant growth and uh, Uh, very smaller or very large aggregates. Uh, so, grade of uh, soil structure. Grades of uh, soil structure. It is a qualitative means of the classification of soil structure. Qualitative uh, means. Uh, of uh, classification of soil structure grades of soil structure are the identified on the basis of the stability of the grades the stability of a grades refers to a their re resistance to uh, uh, dis disruption uh, by uh, impact uh, of uh, rain drops uh, under a submerged condition it is uh, influenced by a moisture content amount uh, and type of clay and uh, nature of the ab uh, adsorbed uh, cation and organic matter content of a soil. High moisture content, colonite clay, uh, devilant uh, cations. And high organic matter content make uh, uh, the aggregates relatively soft. Three structure grades have been identified. To identify as a weak, moderate, and a strong. So, grades of soil structure. Uh, uh, to describe to soil structure the sequence grade class and type of the followed for uh, example strong uh, corus angular blocky moderate thin platy and weak fine uh, prismatic structure like a uh, great weak first one is weak so characteristics are poor uh, poorly formed uh, indistinct pads with uh, uh, which are not as stable moderate moderate uh, moderately developed Pets which are uh, fairly stable and distinct, a strong, a uh, very uh, well developed pet, uh, pet which are uh, quite stable or uh, and distinct. So genesis of a structure, genesis of a structure refers to the uh, cases uh, and the method of formation of aggregates. The following two processes are the involved in the genesis uh, uh, of a uh, structure. Uh, first one is a uh, flocculation. Flocculation. Uh, uh, flocculation. Uh, it is an uh, electrokinetic phenomena. Uh, electrokinetic uh, phenomena uh, is a, in which a positive and negative charge are involved uh, in a uh, soil water suspension. And the clay particles with a high jeta uh, jeta potential uh, repel each other. Uh, with uh, uh, the addition of a uh, flo uh, flocculating agent, a jitter potential is lowered. Uh, the particles come uh, closer and attract uh, each other, resulting in the formation of uh, flocculs of uh, silt size. Uh, flocculs are stable as uh, long as the flocculating agent is uh, present. Flocculations also take place uh, due to uh, hydration, high soluble salt uh, concentration, and the presence of the divalent uh, uh, or uh, trivalent cations. Cementation of locals. Uh, 
it refers to a consolidation of a clay focolates by a cementing material so uh, that they may not get uh, uh, displaced once this have been a flocculate as a flocculates are not a large than a silt size thereby uh, therefore the uh, flocculations would be uh, unfavorable for a plant unless this are further aggregates by uh, inorganic uh, calcium carbonate oxides uh, of a uh, you know uh, iron and aluminum and organic uh, matter cementing materials Fro uh, flocculation of a uh, clay particles is uh, there for the uh, um, pre -requ uh, request for uh, aggregation so aggregation is always refers to a flocculation plus where a uh, plus in the cementing isn't factors influence the formation and the stability of the soil structure so first one is a physical factors physical factors includes the wetting uh, uh, wetting and drying uh, and freezing and uh, thawing uh, alternate um, uh, wetting and drying leads to a formation of a, a smaller aggregates particularly in uh, the fine uh, texture soil uh, drying uh, causes a shrinkage of the soil mass and uh, when the large dry uh, cloud uh, uh, cloth is uh, wetted uh, rapid entire uh, entry of water causes a uh, unequal uh, swelling in the cloud uh, uh, and the cloud is uh, fragmented along the cleavage plane mm -hmm. in the process of wetting increase uh, increasing the pressure of the interrupt uh, air uh, cases distribution uh, of the large uh, cloud into a smaller pieces uh, similarly freezing uh, cases cracks in the large uh, cloud by uh, expressions of a uh, water uh, this cracks like uh, uh crack stakes in a uh, more water upon uh, thawing and get uh, enlarged further of the free uh, re freezing chemical factor chemical factor uh, the chemical factors includes the uh, exchangeable cation and the binding materials clay acts as a uh, cementing agent also uh, swells uh, shrinkage upon the wetting and uh, drying in certain also small aggregates are held together by a covering of the clay particles exchangeable ions such as the uh, calcium magnesium and potassium have a uh, flocculations effect on the clay while uh, sodium has a uh, uh, dispersing effect the uh, sodium ions are dominating uh, on a uh, exchangeable complex of a uh, sodic soil cause a uh, particle uh, particles or repel each other uh, and uh, hinder the formation of the aggregates the divalent cations such as the uh, calcium and magnesium causes the individual colloidal particles to come together and form uh, flocculates calcium also help in uh, binding uh, the organic uh, uh, collides and clay particles hydrate uh, sex uh, swaxe oxide from uh, almost completely in versible uh, collide upon uh, dehydration and the uh, uh, and help in uh, forming stable aggregates uh, as in the lactic soil uh, oxy soil and uh, uh, alti soil called the lactic soil of uh, the uh, humid tropics so spuxy uh, uh, oxides also formed a complex with a uh, humus and calcium carbonate uh, precipitating uh, around the uh, soil particles act as a cementing materials for uh, aggregates and um, uh, imparts a stability to soil aggregates a soluble uh, salt and uh, to enhance a uh, flocculation of the clay even in the sodium saturated clays organic compounds play uh, a key role uh, in uh, aggregation and stabilization of uh, stable uh, stabilization of uh, soil structure fat packs uh, lignin protein uh, resin etc also help uh, stabilizing uh, um, uh, the soil aggregates uh, humans help in the aggregation by the forming clay humus complex only a uh, calcium humus is a uh, flocculate
for collecting do it's a tendency of a from a complex with the organic compounds so through uh, the uh, co ordi uh, uh, the coordination cell linkage the ma magnesium potassium and uh, hydrogen and sodium hum uh, humus is defocalate Uh, and does not help in uh, aggregation synthetic soil conditions long carbon chain organic compounds are also used for uh, soil aggregation these compounds attach uh, time wells to the in uh, exchange sites of the clay and the bind the clay particles together at uh, addition of these compounds in relatively small amounts and can the uh, produce a good structure even a sandy soil biological effects uh, biological factors biological factors the plants and plant residues help the soil particles to bind together uh, gelinations organic uh, uh, compounds uh, extract uh from a root binds and soil particles together root hairs uh, penetrate the soil uh, clots to create a point of the weakness and the ultimately break the uh, clot into a aggregates this also help the soil particles stick together in a gra uh, granular uh, form uh, plant residues uh, uh, serve as a food for uh, microbes which play a, a prime role in the aggregates formation and the produce sticky substance or decompositions microorganism decompose plant and animal residues uh, form a humus and this humus binds uh, the particles together algae fungi actinomycetes and bacteria which continue uh, the living matter in a soil bind soil particles more effectively than the exchangeable ions the small animal like uh, uh, rodent uh, rodents earthworm spiders mites nematodes insect um, centipedes and millipedes etc uh, facilitated uh, the formation of soil aggregates by way of uh, borrowing uh, churning the soil or throughout the um, mixing or uh, the organic residues with uh, the soil evolution of a soil structure the soil structure can be evaluated both of a direct and indirect method a direct method um uh direct method uh, indirect method soil structure is characterized by the observing the shape size and uh, um, arrangement of the soil aggregates either microscopically uh, my, or a microscopically uh, microscopically and microscopically in microscopic technique thin soil section are ex uh, examined uh, under a various types of microscope for shape and size of aggregates uh, and uh, voids for microscopic uh, evolution of large soil clouds in uh, clouds it's a uh, excavated from the field and allowed uh, to uh, fall gently to uh, gently on a smooth surface which uh, breaks into pads of a different size and is, uh, and shape shape and size can also be observed directly from uh, uh, the cleavage of the pads in the soil profile indirect method uh, indirect method involves a measurement of the size distribution of stable aggregates uh, stability of aggregates of the soil uh, uh, property which is the function of soil structure soil is indirect method size distribution of stable aggregates so uh, dry or wet uh, sieving techniques are uh, used uh, for uh, determination of different size stable uh, 
aggregates in direct uh, dry uh, shaving techniques uh, the proportion of a stable uh, uh, aggregates uh, against a vibrating action stimulating of the scoring uh, effect of uh, wind is uh, determined which the provides uh, and the index for a uh, character uh, characterizing uh, the susceptibility of soil to wind erosion in uh, wet uh, shaving technique size distribution of water stable aggregates in uh, determined measurement of the stability of aggregates uh, it is uh, evaluated by the degree of the which soil aggregate uh, resist uh, dispersion several uh, indicators have been uh, uh, developed uh, such as a stability index structure coefficient uh, and dispersion coefficient stability index and uh, uh, is the di difference between a percentage silt uh, and clay as uh, determined by the mechanical analysis and that the obtained by suspension of uh, soil sample in water the uh, great the difference the better in the soil uh, structure structure uh, coefficient is given by uh, uh, d minus s upon s where d is a percentage of particles and uh, less than 0.25 mm in diameter as a determined by the mechanical analysis and the s is the percentage of the aggregates smaller than 0.025 mm in diameter as a determined by the wet shaving method high the value of the structural coefficient the better is the soil structure measurement of the soil properties bulk density Uh, infiltration rate uh, hydraulic conductivity aeration uh, available soil water degree of compaction of soil uh, may be used for uh, evaluation of soil structure so indicates of a soil structure amount of a different size uh, soil aggregates is represented by the single value of the uh, comparing the structural states uh, status of different soil or the same soil under different management part, uh, particles among the various indicates um, uh, mean of weight diameter of the uh, aggregates is a commonly used index of soil structure the uh, mean weight or diameter of aggregates give, uh, gives an uh, estimate uh, of a weighted a uh, percentage of the average size of all the aggregates the proportion by weight uh, of the given size fraction of the aggregates to the total sample weight is a multiplied uh, multiplied by the mean diameter and diameter of the that fractions the sum of this uh, products for the all size fractions gives a mean weight diameter of aggregates in a uh, mm uh, management of a soil structure so the general practices for improvement of the maintenance of the soil structure tillage operation be carried out within the range of the optimum moisture condition to ensure least uh, destruction of the soil aggregate zero and minimum tillage practices be adopted to maintain a uh, adequate aeration and uh, reduce the loss of organic matter a uh, true oxidation of or uh, erosion soil surface be kept uh, covered with the crop residues to pro protect uh, aggregates from the beating action of a uh, rain drops check uh, weed emergence and uh, add organic matter incorporation of the crop residues and the uh, manures into the soil for the stabilizing aggregates uh, introduction uh, of all legumes uh, in crop rotation coupled uh, with the application of the phosphatic fertilizer uh, green manuring and covered uh, crops are a good source of organic matter uh, integrated uh, use of organics and fertilizer for crop productions 
some uh, soil have a specific structural uh, problem which uh, need a proper soil management practices for a better soil um, structure sandy soil this soil have a problem of low water and uh, nutrient uh, uh, retention uh, retention the pa practical method of improve structure of the soil uh, such as soils uh, is to add uh, organic matter directly or uh, uh, through a green manure the addition of the uh, pond sediments can uh, clay soil or uh, even a compaction is uh, helpful uh, in increasing uh, the proportion of a small size pores for the enhancing uh, water and nutrient retention capacity clay soil these soils have a restricted uh, drainage and the uh, aeration due to a poor aggreg uh, aggregations uh, addition of a soil matter through a helpful for improving uh, aggregation but the required amount is a uh, high therefore a uh, crop rotation and use of phosphatic fertilizers are useful uh, uh, raised or uh, raised uh, bed cultivation can reduce uh, the uh, aeration stress problem to uh, to some ex uh, extent um, Flood condition in areas under a uh, uh, prolonged uh, water logging, the soil aggregations are broken, leading to flood condition, poor drainage, and possible solution of a soil problem. Dispersed condition, the problem of dispersion is found in a sodic soil.